Hi, Lale. Hi, Chitissa. How are you? I'm good. Thank you. How about you? I am beyond excited that we're going to be having this conversation today. So I wonder where we're going to go. <laughs> well, the conversation I would like to have with you today, it's about right riches for you. And even though you are our creative producer, you are also a right riches for you facilitators. And you do a lot of classes yourself that not too many people actually know about it because you are just so amazing at promoting all of us and, you know, supporting all of us. So I would like to talk to you and find out a bit more about what you are actually doing yourself as a Right Riches for You facilitator. And I really love your, uh, your next um, Right Riches for You class. I think it's called The Way to Easy Street. Where Money Leaves. I really adore that title. So I'm just wondering whether you could actually talk a little bit about how did you come up with that title and what that title actually really means? Thank you so much, by the way, for all of that. That just was so wonderful. Um, yeah, with Right Riches, you know, it means different things. For me, Right Riches is really about you having anything you'd like to have in your life, and that includes money. It's not about separating money, but it includes money. And one of the things that I really had to come to the acknowledgement and awareness of is my life has always been different than everyone else's. Um, I would have, there were moments in my life where I would have never said my life was easy, but when I look at the way that I even got divorced or I look at my career path in the corporate world or not for profit or starting my own business, like where most people have difficulty and they struggle, for me, I actually had it easier. And there's just ways that you can put things in your life that don't have to be the, the difficult, hard road and have them be pragmatic, have them be tools that you can use immediately, not wait till you've done plan A, B, C, D, all the way to Z before you can actually see some results. And that's where this class came from. How to share what has worked for me and being able to really create whatever it was, whether it's businesses, which I have multiple businesses currently, whether it's been to generate, create wealth um, in my personal life, as well as that with others. Um, and the way to easy street where money lives is actually a title Gary Douglas helped to come up with for me. And I love it because it is about embracing what are things that you actually are in the world? What are things that you as that conscious leader are already being and doing you as that mom, you as, you know, um, whatever your title is in your job, like there's so many things that we actually do really well. And there's things that we do that are so much fun for us. And what if you also could generate cash while you were part of your easy life? And, um, that's what this upcoming class is, is how to share that with others so that they can apply it into their lives and I, I do hope that they'll be able to be then, you know, the inspired people to be able to share with others. So it creates that domino effect of us utilizing what actually our gifts and talents are and spread that to the world. I just, uh, I just adore the title, the, the word Easy Street. It has such a, a, a really amazing energy when I, I heard you mention that to me the other day. Easy street is a street for every one of us to choose to be and choose to, to, to live in that easy street. And most of us tend to choose to live in the, the difficult, struggling and, and trauma and drama street. So what would it be like to choose to go into the easy street and get out of the trauma and drama street into the more easy street? Where the money lives. I love that. So I love it. I'm gonna to have to steal that for the way that I get to share this class with <laughs> others. But it really is. Like we really have options. Okay. There's so many different ways that we can do different things, whether it's creation of something new or 
something's working, not working, wanting to improve it. And there are many avenues that we can go down. And sometimes we do have people who, no matter what the options are, they do choose the more difficult route, the more tra trauma and drama. And I realized like most of my life, that really hasn't been where I function. Um, I did work a lot with people, whether it was my family, friends, coworkers, clients, whatever, where they seem to lean more towards the difficulty. And, and that's the gift that I'd like to share with others. What if it doesn't have to be trauma and drama? What if it doesn't have to be difficult? And what if you can actually explore all these other options and possibilities that are available to you versus assuming you only have option A and B? We do have a choice to choose which street we want to live and to create and to generate our lives. So it sounds so much fun. Yeah, and I'm excited. I mean, you know, like you just said right now, what if it doesn't matter where you were yesterday? You know, like I know a lot of people are like, well, where I live is sometimes codependent on the amount of money I have in my bank account or these other things that they come up with. But what if it's not? What if it is actually exploring what are places that would actually be a gift for you, your body, your family, like where it would actually create something different for you? Um, and not look at yesterday from what's gonna hold you back. Yesterday has occurred, now is today. What can you choose today that actually will allow you to choose and pick and have the have part of it of this new neighborhood that you like to live in this new house that you like to live in and it doesn't have to be a new house but it's like what are these other things that you actually can add into your life mm -hmm. and not be codependent on where you were yesterday or you know what occurred in your life in the past um you know when i when you talk about the houses i laugh my husband and i when we got married I had just already moved into a house and, you know, I'd looked for years for this neighborhood. It was perfect one for my kids in the school. And we were there. And of course, within the first two years, I pretty much rebuilt the whole house, you know, the kitchen and every part of it. And um, as soon as the remodel was done, I was like, let's move. <laughs> and he looked at me and he thought I was crazy. He's like, what are you talking about? We just redid this whole house. And I said to him, I can't explain it to you, but there's something here that lets me know, I'm very grateful for what we have, but something else better is available to us. And that's before I knew all these awesome Right Riches For You tools. Um, and it is, it's like, what if we actually know something greater is available? And what if putting the, I desire to have it and actually having it doesn't have to be difficult. So I'm just wondering whether, is that because people don't know what the East Street, East Street would look like? And is that the space that you are in your class, you might sort of uh, facilitate and explore with people? What does it mean to actually have an easy life, easy street, and how they could actually claim on and acknowledge that space themselves? You nailed it, Jatissa, because it is. It's like... What if, one, there's no prerequisites to this class. So you don't need to already be living on easy street and you don't even have to want to have the easy street for every part of your life. But it's exploring, wow, what would that be like for me, you know? And the things that we talk about in this class is pragmatic tools of right riches that end up being tools you can apply into every aspect of your life. Money is just one of those particular areas. Um, and you know, it's funny because when you said it, you know, when you were when you were just asking that question, I get like how many of us really think we already need to have the answers already figured out before we say, okay, is this gonna work for me or not? But what if it's not? It's about exploring. And if it doesn't work for you, you don't have to do it either. Or you may choose to modify it a certain way that will work for you and may not work for somebody else. And yeah. that's the other thing. Easy street for me may look very different than easy street for you. Absolutely. There's infinite number of streets 
infinite yes. number of possibilities that we all can choose. The people that come to these classes all vary, various backgrounds, various education, various lives. And, you know, the classes themselves, what I also love is that they really create themselves based on the people and their questions and where they, where they want to go. And with the, like, easy street is this relative word that just can mean so many different things to so many different people. So I, I, I love it. Like it is about exploration and you know, my favorite part about facilitating, I'm not there to be a teacher. I'm there to facilitate and I'm there to share, share ideas and, but also receive. And this is where others in the class and, and whoever's attending, they're part of what we also get out of this class. So, you know, I am really wondering like who will be part of the next, the way to easy street where money lives and what that class might look like versus another class that might happen literally a month later. When is the first class going to be and where? The first class is actually September 14th and 15th and it's gonna be live um, in person in Potomac, Maryland. Um, and it also is live stream. So people get to be on Zoom just like this and get to watch it from anywhere around the world. Um, the other classes we've had like this, we've had people in Australia, we've had them in Europe, we've had them in Brazil, we've had them in all these different time zones. They could be in their pajamas, they could be in their suit from work. So it really ends up being anyone anywhere around the world. That's exciting. So how, how, how would people register if they want to come? So you can go to, actually there's two websites that you can register to. So we've got um, accessconsciousness.com under Lale Hancock, and it will have the name of the class called The Way to Easy Street Where Money Lives, um, as well as you can go to bellapimo.com, which is my consulting company as well. And uh, bellapimo.com under events also has it under our calendar and you can register and pay there. That's awesome. And also, I, I know that you're doing something else on Facebook as well. September is the month of money. And there are actually a few different things going on. But one of them is money, 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 a 21 day energy pull. Um, and all of that will be done via Facebook Live. And we have eight or nine languages actually part of that. So um, it, it is about inviting money into your life through um, energy pools and um, different ways that we can invite money in. And what I love is when you invite money in, you're not just inviting money. It ends up being all these other things as part of your life. It could be joy. It could be relationships and other things that you pull in as well. Awesome. So they can go on your Facebook and join. Yes, yes. For the energy pool, you can go to globalwellnessforall.com, which is the other business <laughs> under events, as well as Global Wellness for All Facebook and join us. And I'm so excited. We did a quickie um, Facebook Live today and just the enthusiasm and excitement. I just can't even wait till these classes get started. Awesome. Thank you so much, Lale, for sharing all this with us. And I really just want people to know that you are doing all kinds of amazing things besides being a creative producer of Bright Riches for you. And thank you for everything you be and do.